That boy, there's that M8 coal. I can show it now. In the daylight, last night, you know, it was dark. See that up there? Off the range, high conductor. Speed four, sensitivity 25. Hear anything? Six. Hear a little noise at twenty six. Twenty five. See what I got here. I'm just practically standing straight on them there, okay? Turn this camera on. Let's walk over here to the silver dime. Alright, <clears throat> give you a little information on this small call as far as sharpshooters use of it, okay? Your results may vary, but I doubt they vary much. Screen presentation using this small cowl of this manticore. You're going to find out you're going to get your best screen presentation. Speed three, four, perhaps five. The faster speed setting on this detector, the screen presentation becomes, let's just say it's either, it's not necessarily non existent, but it is very dim. This call does perform well. I've used it a whole lot of speed forward. That's what I really like with this call in my area mostly, okay? But some people could use this at speed three and milder ground. You might even use it at speed two, okay? I've got this silver dime here. Now, this is, you know, I don't, I'm not going to tell you how deep this call is because that's impossible for me to tell based on your area. That ruler down there is hung on the number 25. See it there? It's a mercury silver dime, and I'm at 25 sensitivity, all terrain, high conductor, speed four. Now I'm going to sweep down here a little closer. Here's about six inches. And you get to see what that trace looks like. Okay, now I'm going to intentionally dial this thing to speed seven. So your trace gets fainter, okay? I'm raising the call. I'm pretty high right there in speed seven, boys. My D gets a little shakier, okay? Speed four. Once you see that right there. Still getting 80 in that meter on that dime right there. I'm just gonna push this call over to the right. The call's coming up on the number 17, okay? Now, that's eight inches. With good ID and the air test easily, okay? The settings in this machine. You're not helpless out using this call when it comes to depth, okay? But now, coin orientation, you know, a bigger call can have advantage, okay? But then you're talking about this call could have some advantage too around maskers, okay? The machine feels good with this call on there. It's not, it's not back heavy it's not front heavy it feels real good okay i've got quite a few hours using that particular size call right there on this detector and uh some high iron sights it pulled me some goods boys it pulled some high conductors running all terrain high conductor even okay 
So yeah, it's a, they can get you some stuff, okay? I'm not telling anybody to buy one, I'm just telling you. If you have the Manicore platform, you see that dot in that screen? Now this is our test, okay? But this machine being multi-frequency and all the air test results and the way this machine presents ID, you know, this would be a good indication in medium and milder ground for mineralization of what you would probably see on this detector. Okay. Just a little preview there of it. We'll talk some more about it a little later. Hope you enjoyed.